Let's meditate for a few minutes. Anam Pavana Sapakta. Make a survey of your body. Make a survey of your mind. How's the body doing right now? Take a couple of good, long, deep in and out breaths. And notice how far the breath goes into the body. If it seems to be blocked, think of that blockage opening up. So when you breathe in, it's the whole body breathing in, the whole body breathing out. And then survey your mind. Is your mind willing to stay here? Or is it looking for the first chance to run off? When it runs off, it doesn't know itself. When it stays here, it has a chance to know itself. Because we can pay attention to the ways that it creates thoughts, the ways that it creates little worlds in which, into which it goes, and then goes traveling. If you go into those worlds, that's all you see is the, the world from the inside. You don't see the process of how it gets shaped and how it begins to destroy itself, and then how you go scrounging around looking for a new one. If you really want to make sure that you're not creating any suffering for yourself or other people, you have to learn how to watch these processes here in the present moment. This is the news you've got to pay attention to. We pay far too much attention to the news that comes through the media. But think about it. When you die, are they going to have a quiz on world events? No. The quiz will be, what did you do with your life? What kind of things did you do? What kind of things did you say? What kind of things did you think? That's the quiz you're going to have to pass. You pass it best by getting to know your mind right here. So look at the news right here, right now. This is the news that's really important. And keep, keep up with this news, because the mind is always finding new things to think about, new ways to create trouble for itself. If you can't think of new ways, it'll go back for the old ways. So we have to learn how to understand what's going on, watch what's going on, observe it. So we have a sense of what's causing what inside. And when you know that news, then that's news you can do something about. There's so many things we read about, hear about, we can't do anything about at all. But right here is an area where you can make big changes, and they are important changes. So keep up with this news, and you'll always be up to date.